guys, there we have it. Priest in Peril completed. We got some prayer levels. Oh, 14 to 18. That's good. And now we have access to Mauritania. We got the Wolf Bane Dagger. We can do Canifis Roof to Bitch, what the fuck? Bitch. Ugh, come on. So yeah, we have the rooftop agility and we have the, like the Slayer Tower. I can get some more jewelry from the Crawling Hands. I can do Banshees for um, Essence. I can get Banshees in current at the Catacombs for Essence and Elks and good stuff. So there's a lot we can do and we just unlocked, well, quite a huge area. So I'm excited about that. Plague City quest completed. Um, we got some mining XP. That's really good. Uh, 350 total. And now we need to do Biohazard quest. I'm not excited for this quest because it's it's just not nice. Uh, but I'm gonna do that. And then why have we also get the uh, the telly to Arden when we have 51 magic? But yeah, we're gonna use the we're gonna do the quest biohazards in a little bit, and then we can get the RD cape. Time to get our RD cloak. We just completed biohazard quest, and it was quite fine. I uh, didn't mess up anything. It went perfectly well. Uh, we got some thieving XP from it, no level, and now we have ourselves an RD cloak. RD elite, easy. Uh, yeah, sure, elite. Easy done. We get an XP lamp and some cloaks, which means, of course, we can tell it to RD unlimited amount of times. We can recharge a prayer. We can mine iron ore, all that good stuff. And we have some XP to spend. I know we should put it on her blur, so I'm just going to put it on her unit level 30. So there is only three skills I can use it on, which are magic, agility, and thieving. Ah, uh, that's... Can, I hope I can bank it, if not I will use it on uh, probably magic. But yeah, we got this cape which has plus two magic bonus, so it's already another upgrade. So the account is getting much better ever so steadily. So we're about to get level 50 agility. And that means that when I have that I'm going to try pyramid agility pyramid again for the third time. I went the first time, I couldn't even get past the second level. I went a second time, I couldn't get past the third level. But then I was like 30, 38 agility. Now I'm 49, um, we're going to get 50. But, besides having 50 agility, and being able to do the felly course now, and this being our highest level, I also have 98 marks of grace. Now I have the gloves, and that's about it. I'm not buying the boots anytime soon, because I have the boots of lightness. But I need two more marks of grace, and then I can buy the legs and the cape, which respectively make um, the weight minus 10 kilos, as they cost 60 and 40 grace pieces. So I need two more marks, and then buying the cape, buying the legs, and then we're going to go and do agility pyramid, hopefully, Hopefully being able to complete it and then train some agility with that as well. Get like a big pile of cash and then actually continue the account because this is literally just build up, you know, like when you make an account and you want to do it efficiently, you have to like build it up really slowly with shit things you don't like. That's what we're doing now. It's time for another huge but super tiny um, thing we achieved. What, what, what's the word I'm looking for? A thing we achieved we achieved the thing and that thing is we completed the Lumbridge easy diary and that unlocks us the ring probably a few more things honestly oh yeah <coughs> low alchemy 30 times a day that's easy oh, it recharges half of our own energy twice a day so that's really nice because I do need that need that now um, I want to get a few more rings like five of them or something and uh, I think sadly we cannot use the lamp on anything useful because you need to have level 30 in the skill <coughs> I'm not using it on agility uh, honestly what I'm gonna do <sighs> should I 
I just put on magic again? Oh, that's a waste. Mining. It's so stupid, this is. I think I should get level 30 crafting and then use it on that, but I'm not sure how I'm going to do that. But now at least we have a ring, which we didn't have previously. Gives a prayer bonus, not that it's useful, but uh, yeah, we got something. Also, Agility Pyramid was a success. I did 8 runs, so I made 80k. As you can see, I've been doing some Sedamai. I don't know why the RuneScape crashed, but that's nice because we got the 35 Agility. We got 35 Agility just now. That's been my goal. Um, you get nice extra runes. It's a bit annoying because it costs a lot of runes to bank, but you do get a lot back for it. So you get some Law, Nature runes, a lot of Cosmics, which can be useful too. So. My plan is to do the quest What Lies Below and you need 41 mining and 35 ring crafting and what the quest does it gives you a ring that gives magic attack bonus which is the best ring I can get until I unlock Sears rings which is not going to be in uh, any time ever. So I'm going to do a quest, well I'm going to go do mining or continue with this a little bit more but I think 35 ring crafting to begin with is really quite nice. You unlock the chaos runes and the quest what lies below is about, well, the chaos tunnels and stuff like that. So, uh, also the two fire runes. That's cool. Um, let's have a look at the amount of runes I've gotten so far. And, uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's a little bit, like a lot of cosmics and a few lore runes, all that good stuff. I've got 500 more, um, ugh, I wasted runes because I needed food. I just walk, fuck it. Um, I've wasted a lot of uh, Earth Runes banking and I have a few more pure essence to go so I can train probably to like 38 but for now we have the goal reached and I'm just going to do the quest soon. Right, we have the Abyss mini quest completed by this. We get 1k um, runecraft and XP, we have access to the Abyss and we get a small pouch. No runecraft in level though but we need this because I don't have a chaos talisman because I'm doing what lies below. Um, should I read all of this? I've got the 42 mining. Um, so what is this abyss stuff? Yeah, we have to unlock the abyss as well. I've got the 42 mining. I just started what lies below. I'm going to do the quest, but we have to go to the chaos altar, which you need either the abyss for or a uh, talisman, obviously. So we got this in preparation and I'm going to do the quest right now. What? Right, let's talk to Rat. Complete the quest, what lies below. That was easy. Uh, what's my orders? What? Oh my god, I'm so confused. I, I did the whole thing. I did the fuck. Um, I think because I deceit for like one second during the cutscene without even logging out, the quest got fucked, and now we have to kill King Roald again. Do the whole thing again. It's annoying, but at least it's easy to kill. So I guess we'll be done in like two minutes. Let's try this again, please. He was on 1 HP, should be perfectly fine, please, yes, <sighs> come on, no, don't crash now, okay, please, yes, the cutscene is continuing this time, that's good, that's what we want, I'll see you guys at Red Burgess and complete the quest there, okay, we're here, we're done, finally, hopefully, and it's a good quest to do, it's so easy, yes, gift the experience, 2k, that XP, we're almost another level, 1 XP, 1 XP to level 24, uh, we get 8k rune crafting, we went from 35 to 38, and we get, of course, we get the, the beacon ring, and the beacon ring does this, plus 28, plus 30, and plus 20, plus 8.
the pawn, 19. Okay, so plus two magic attack bonus, which honestly, it's the best ring we can get until we have the Seer's ring, which is going to take a while before we even do the Dagon of Kings. <laughs> so I think it's a really good update upgrade. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to go to Mauritania and just kill Banshees for a long time because they drop the gloves. They're the best gloves I can get because... I cannot upgrade these further than iron and then they give only plus two. Well, the mystic gloves give plus four magic attack bonus. So I'm trying to upgrade my gear so I have, well, better gear.